Good morning, gang. It's Wellness Wednesday in the 55 plus community. And today, we're as it relates to wellness, we're going to talk about the fact that we've made this a safe place for all of us. Which, by the way, now, if you haven't heard, we did pass over 2,000 people. So we doubled very, very quickly and uh, in size. And it's absolutely awesome. Which, by the way, I want to make sure you know, there is going to be a week of games that you can get your name in the drawing. And we will have uh, Dallas and Steve U coming on. And there will be another giveaway. Uh, last time we we uh, Dallas had given away a signed copy of his book. So I'm hoping that's the same thing this time because that's a precious treasure. So anywho, so congratulations to all of you. You get the word out. People are finding us. I didn't even know when I began. I didn't even know, even though I'm 69 and I was 67 when I started, I didn't actually know there were people my age group. So pretty exciting to see all of you guys in here. So we're, we're going to talk about the safe place today uh, for wellness, right? And that is how we take care of one another inside what has clearly exploded our 55 plus family. So I want to cover just the basics of what what are the things uh, that we need in place to make sh to keep this a safe place, right? And um, I want to say right up front, I cannot thank uh, the top contributors enough. They are like little mini policemen in here, and when they see something, they see it very quickly, and they message me, Pam. I think there's something here, um, and there's also I think something you can uh, click on as well with a post and send me a message. I go in right away, that person is gone. They had a motive. It wasn't the right motive to be in our family here. So they're always caught real quickly. And I'll be honest with you, there's even a few people right now, well, specifically one that I can think of that um, a couple of them are watching because it's looking a little different. And if it flips and that person uh, gets out of control with the things I'll share in just a moment, hey, they'll be gone that same day. So this is your safe place. You can know there's wellness here because we have all these contributors watching. And by the way, you as well can be that watcher for us. Any one of you that see anything that you think is a little not right, please message me right away because we don't want anybody to spend more than a, an hour in here if they came in with the wrong motives. So Thank you all for being a part of that and reaching to me the minute you see something that isn't quite right. And if you're wondering, well, what isn't quite right? I'm gonna, I'm gonna cover that right now. So you know what is completely not acceptable uh, by DDP and um, uh, DDP himself and Steve Yu. So this is Wellness Wednesday. This is about the wellness of our 55 plus community. And of course, we can't thank enough uh, DDP, Dallas, coach to me, and Steve U, who put this in place for us. They also created, by the way, they created a list of rules that they wanted people to stay within if they wanted to be a part of their uh, 55 plus group, right? So big shout out to to Dallas and to Steve Yu, but also a big shout out to all of you that are watching carefully and making sure if there's anything not quite right, you let me know right away and I appreciate that. So I'm gonna go over real quickly what things they put in place uh, to protect us, okay? First rule is you must be 55 plus to join and you could read, I'll, I'll post this down below. You can uh, read why, but I have to tell you I am, I, I don't know. I guess I probably turned away more than a thousand already. But um, people say, hey, I'm not, but I feel like I'm 55. Couldn't I be in? And the, the stuff goes on and on. And I find it adorable, actually, that they say those things. But I have to say, I am so sorry, but that's a rule they put in place. I, I don't need any, I don't create the rules. I just help it. Um, Put them in place, follow through with them. Okay, number two is be kind and courteous. I haven't seen anybody, anybody that hasn't been kind and courteous 
in this family. But seriously, if you ever see it, let me know. So number three, this is a beginner group. Focus on beginner posts. Uh, that just means uh, we're, we're just taking this to a level that everybody can connect. Brand new people can come on in here. They see stuff. They're not overwhelmed. Uh, you notice I fo focus a lot, by the way. Did you see the last two days? It had um, people from our family featured. Uh, on uh, Monday, of course, we, we had, um, oh my gosh, you'd think I was awake yet this morning, uh, Rick Kenzel's family on. And of course, yesterday we had a PT, another P physical therapy panel. And those gals were fabulous. I hope you go back and watch that. These are people in our own family that should take their time and share their heart, right? But as you notice, we focus on what are the beginning basics. That's what we do here. Number four, and this is actually the biggest one that has sent a few people out the door immediately. No sales posts or trying to get coaching clients. Now, this I will read you the details to this one because this is the only one we've seen violated, but it's pretty big and they need to be gone the minute it happens. This group is about one thing, DDPY. It is not a commercial site to sell things, especially if they are not DDP yoga related. This includes fundraisers, charity donations, as well as any vote for me contests. Also, please refrain from offering coaching services here. Uh, that's what the official uh, coaching sites are for. You can go to the sites uh, that offers all the coaching and the trainers. That's there on the DDPY site. This is not, a, this is a safe place because this is not a place anybody can come in and try to sell us things. That's not allowed, right? Uh, number five is keep attire more modest in this group. And you do see a whole lot more skin shared in the bigger DDPY family. So when they created this 55 plus, their vision was that we would be different, that we would have a place that 55 and up would feel more comfortable in. You can still show a ton of skin over in the bigger group, but they did want this one to be a little bit more modest, right? Um, and the last one is probably my favorite because it says, this is not a dating site. So um, I had to giggle actually when I read that because Scott and I will have been married 49 years this fall. So I don't even actually think of that kind of thing, but I am very much aware um, that there are people in, we live in a 55 plus community, right? Um, so I see all the dating going on. I hear about the people that are uh, running like maybe five people at a time, spinning five plates at a time on some dating site that's for 55 plus. So I know when someone really wants to find someone, they do a lot of things. And that's okay that you do those things. It's just, they don't want this spot to be a spot that anyone feels like they're being targeted. So, but I, you know, we've been, they launched this last October and I have to say, I haven't, I haven't seen anything like that. All the men in here are so respectful and it's been powerful to see the friendships that develop in here. We are one family, you guys. So thank you to all of you for, you clearly run these rules uh, and show respect to Dallas and Steve U. It's really clear you guys all make an effort. I love all of your posts. I wish I could comment on all of them. Uh, really my schedule doesn't permit that, um, but I do go in and, and scan, uh, scan different things throughout there because I wanna make sure Monday through Friday, when I post these, I want to make sure these are all things that are important to you, that you're asking questions or you're highlighting. And I want to make sure all of our Monday through Friday posts are about you and DDPY. That's it. So anywho, love you tons. Have a fabulous Wednesday. If you didn't see Monday and Tuesday's post, uh, please go over there and see it because those were all people from our 55 plus family. So love you tons. Uh, congratulations on going over 2,000 of us already. It's 
incredible. Uh, actually, I have to say this. So when Steve, you called me the day in like October or whatever, and said, we've been thinking about launching a 55 plus group. So there's a separate side group that's also in the bigger group, but a separate side. And um, when he told me, I said, oh, I'd be honored to be a part of that. Uh, and then he said, Pam, I really don't know how many there'll be. There might only be a few. We have no way of knowing. And I thought the same thing. I was thinking, I hope Steve U knows. I haven't seen anybody really in here much my age group. Maybe I could count on one or two hands. I don't know. So the fact that we went over 2000 since last October already definitely was a giant, wonderful thing for Steve U in Dallas to see. And it is for me, too, because I didn't know. There's so many of us. It's great. Uh, love you tons. Have a dynamite Wednesday, by the way. We will see you tomorrow for Transformation Thursday. How are you going to get your transformation? How are we going to get our transformation? Those are the things we talk about on Thursdays. So have a great one, you guys. Love you as always.